me, me, me. Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to episode eight of Black Ops 3 Mod Tools. Now, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to add guns to the wall. So, let's open up Radiant. Hate that sound. All right. Now, I'm going to open up uh, Undead. There you go. All right. Radiant's loading. And let's see how we can do this. All right. I just had somebody hit me up in the comments about maybe 10 minutes ago on how to add viable um, items. So, here we go. All right, now this is the effects from um, episode seven. And I just put in some guns, you know, just to test it out. Right now I'm in um, F9, which is a uh, game view. So that's what it looks like. So I'm gonna get rid of these. Actually, I'm gonna just get rid of that one. And let me show you guys how to do this. All right, so you're going to open up your Entity Browser, uh, press B, and you're going to scroll down to MISC, and you're going to go to Prefab, and you're going to just put it right on the wall where you want it. There you go. Now we're going to go to into ZM, ZM Core, and we're going to move down, and it says Spawnable Weapon, and these are all the weapons right here. Now you have the long burst, you have the the marksman, uh, standard, bouncing Betty's, buoy. Oh, that's cool. Let me put a buoy knife. All right, so I'm gonna click on that. Now you do have to rotate it. So hit shift, hold shift, and press D. There you go. Now let me move it out a little bit. Let me go into 2D. Back it up a little bit. There you go. Now this green part right over here. That's letting you know how high you should put the gun. <clears throat> so just drop it down a little bit. That's good right there. And it's against the wall. And hit escape. Now if I press F9 to show um, game mode, you can see I put the Bowie knife. And I have a gun right next to it. So it's that simple. Now right now, um, Treyarch hasn't really released too many guns for you to put into the game. At least I haven't found them yet. So, you know, you got to remember, this is in beta. So, for right now, there's a lot of assets that are going to be added to the game. So, right now, we have a lot of X models and perks and stuff like that. But within the coming weeks, they're going to keep adding more. So, we're going to be getting a lot of updates. You know, we just got to be patient and rock with what we have now. But um, let me save this. And I'm going to load up the map so we can try it out, make sure it works. There you go, build the map. And if there's any kind of videos you guys want to see, you know, just hit me up in the comments. And, you know, I just should get back to you. So let's just give it a few seconds. You know, I'm already getting a lot of overwhelming support, so it's, of course I'm going to go all out for you guys, you know? You know, but hit that like button or subscribe so, you know, the word can get out about my videos. You know, the more people that see them, the more people know what to do. So, alright, we're good to go. We go over to Steam. Hit OK. In the next video, I should be doing lights, or at least lighting, because there's a lot of features that aren't displayed on Radiant that you guys should be using. So, most likely that'll be my next video. Hopefully it'll come out later on today. Well, depending on when you're watching this video, it might be out already. Alright, let's give it a few seconds. And let's see if we were able to add a viable gun. It's my first time doing it, so... Well, it's, I just did it earlier, but same thing. All right, this is the effects I added from episode seven. You know, I just threw it in the game, so. Right now, there's three, eff three effects in this. There's the fire, the black smoke, and the white smoke, a little gray. And here's the Bowie knife. There you go, you need 3,000 to get it. And I just put in this Vesper. That's 1250, I could get that one at least. Come here, zombie. Eat it. Put that in there. 
Now, once I'm done with the bare essentials of, you know, certain videos, like how to add guns, how to add the box. Oh, the box is another thing. I've noticed that not too many people are watching that video. Now, what's cool about my video is that I actually have the one from UGX. So, it's more than one box. It's actually prefabs you're going to download. And, you know, it's, it has at least four different chests where you can put it in different areas. So, just need a little bit more money. Alright, let's wait for the zombie to pop up. And if you guys want to see a video on disabling dogs, just let me know. Because not everybody wants dogs. And if you're doing a setup, you know, it's a template map, I know you're going to have to add them. Or else, once you get up to like round 6 or 7, the game is going to stop. Alright, let's get that gun. We're going to need it now. And here we go. Oh, I love this gun. Oh, my God, bitch. There we go. And there you have it, guys. That's how you add buyables. Or at least buyable guns. So uh, hit that like button and subscribe now. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.